Morning, ladies and gents. Blue Shade Beauty. How are y'all doing today? Hopefully, you're doing pretty good because I'm doing pretty good too. Now, get you right into this one because I got a lot of new stuff in this one. And uh, yeah, this is more of the stuff that I won from uh, Jimmy NYC Wet Shaving's 900 subscriber giveaway. So, we're going to be using it today. And some of this stuff I haven't even used before. So, we're going to start out with the brush today. Brush we're going to be using today, one thing that I won, it's a uh, DIS Cosmetic 24 millimeter tube in gel tip. I've never used a gel tip brush before. Barber pole handle. Oh uh, yeah, DS Cosmetics there. Gel tip. Now it seems scratchy, but yeah, once you put it in the water and soak it, it's, it's gel. Cause I messed with it. I didn't shade with it, but yeah, never used a gel tip before. So let me shave my mug. Let that soak while we talk about some other stuff. Put that in there. Never used a gel tip before. It's gonna be this is new for me. So, there. Just let that, let that soak for a little bit. DE razor we're going to be using today. I only have four days worth of growth. So, we're going to be using a light razor. Uh, Phoenix Arts and Accoutrements Nickel Plated DOC. Got that Phoenix on there. From the rising from the ashes. DE blade we're going to be using today. <coughs> we are going with... Gillette Nosset. I haven't used one of these in a while. I know everybody loves these. So, we'll use Gillette Nosset today. How you guys doing today? Saturday here. Weekend. Everybody working for the weekend. That's loaded up in there. I forgot my Allen block. Camera edit. <laughs> I always forget for some reason. I don't know why. Oh, well. All right, so, another thing I got from Jimmy. Never used it before. Never, ever used this company before. Very first time, and that is True Fitting Hill, St. James, London, established 1805, Sandalwood Shaving Cream. Never used this company before. It's got that kind of Tobbs type packaging. Established 1805, True Fitting Hill, True Fitting Hill, St. James Street, London, SW1A1PH, England. I don't know. I don't know what that means. You guys check that out. You guys probably know what this is. <laughs> On the front of it, it's got it's got this crest right here. And it says, God is my help. By appointment to the to HRH, the Duke of Ingdenburg hairdressers. True Fit and Hill Sandwich Shaving Cream. And it says truefitandhill.co.uk. Yeah. Never used this stuff before, so gonna be using it today comes with a little lid like that and oh yeah it's in there i know you guys can't there now you can see it got this from jimmy so we're gonna use it i already got some of it loaded up in my bowl but scent wise it says sandalwood to me to me i know everybody's nose is different but to me this i think this would pair well with phoenix artists and accoutrements um future fiction it reminds me of that in a little a little bit it's Colony, it's fresh, sophisticated, I guess you could say, high classy, I guess you could say. Yeah, I, it reminds me of PA Future Fiction. So if you have that, I think it would match well. And if you've smelt that, then you kind of know. I know everybody's nose is different, but that's what that's what I'm picking up from it. So that's what we're going to be using today. So here we go. That should be soaking long enough, right? Take that out. <laughs> Bring that out a little bit. Yeah, see? A lot different from when you first... That's all scritchy, but now you can see it's all gel tips. All right, let's load this up. A little bit of water in my bowl. Here we go. Never used this stuff before. But it smells really, really good. Oh, yeah. Stuff I see on True Fit and Hill. They're the oldest barber shop in the world. The one in London, UK. Um, they actually do have a couple, from what I know, I've read a little bit of research. Um, they've got one in Chicago, I believe. There's one in India, and I believe there's one in Australia as well. But the one in London, England, is, or the UK, is the oldest one. And their auction, actually what I read is how they got their hairdresser name. They were one of the first companies to actually cater to women. So that's why they can put the word hairdresser in the name of their company. 
It's a really soft brush. Never used a gel tip before, so yeah. I think that should be good. Alright, let's see. That's good. Pre shave we're gonna be using today. Phoenix Arts and Coochman's Mentalator Cube 2.0. Chocolatey goodness. Makes it look like you have more facial hair. <laughs> Gel tips. Never used these before. Never used gel tips before. I should be good. Yeah. Soft. Really, really soft. Like when you first, when it has no water on it, it's real scratchy and scratchy. You're like, man, this is gonna be real scratchy. This is very, very like soft. It's almost like rubbing a blanket on your face. It's that soft to me. I mean, look, it's a floppy too. <laughs> Okay. Set that aside. Yeah, that gel tip it oh, seems to be it seems to retain the water pretty well. I could have wrung it out a little bit better. Razor up. I don't block on my fingers. Go past number one. Very good, very nice. Ah, oh, yeah, nice smell, nice, nice scent. Like I said, it reminds me of PA Future Fiction, if you guys have smelt that one before. Just to give you an idea, but that's my nose. Yeah, very good. Good. Far this blade with this razor is working pretty good too. Very mild razor, but you know Gillette Noss has a little sharper blade. Like I say a lot of people like it. Like a lot of people like Gillette Noss as does like their number one top pick. So try not cutting ourselves. <laughs> yeah. Already did. Huh. Dang it. Oh well. One little weeper. Poor little guy.
My thickest area right here. Very good though, this is nice. Besides that one, which that's my problem area, this is pretty good, pretty good shave so far. Pretty nice cream, nice brush. Never used a gel tip before. So yeah, it's very soft. It's almost like tricky. It almost like tricks you. <laughs> Cause you feel it, it's like, man, it's like sandpaper. And when you wet it, oh like I'm like it's so soft. And I can blink it. Oh, I got cat rubbing on you. <laughs> Like, not screechy at all. And what I've, from what I've heard and seen um, from others using a gel tip, when, you, when you're done cleaning it, um, you just rinse it out really good. Do not rub it on a towel. Like, I repeat, do not rub it on a towel because those... If you look when it's dry, it's like a hook. They're like little hooks. It's almost like a fish hook. So if you're rubbing it on there, you're going to ruin it. It's going to... Not good for it. So you don't... From what I've seen, what I've heard others talk about, you do not want to dry a gel tip brush on a towel. Just let it air dry. Wring it out the best you can and just let it sit and air dry. Because I believe you rub it on a towel, then you're going to ruin it. Alright, now we're good. Let's go with the mustache. Doo -doo -doo. Yeah, got water. It's, it's real watery though. I could have wrung it out like a little more. I can't, I just can't, I can't get over how soft that is. Yeah, you can buff this. <laughs> buff it with the razor. You guys know I don't do upstrokes on my uh, mustache. It don't go against the grain. I usually get weepers really bad, and I just do... I can do with that. That's fine with me. Alright, that's it. <laughs> Woo, yeah. One weeper there, one here, not bad, but that is it. So, <laughs> clean up and be right back. Okay, I'm back. Yeah, very good, very smooth, very close. One weeper there, probably my fault. Talking, blah, blah, blah. Had one there, went away, all good. Not even gonna use a stick 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 on that, so. Just gonna use the album block. Album block. Block, block, block. Add them on there. Add them is good if you have a knee. I leave it on. I don't wash it up. I just leave it. Some wipe it off, some don't. I leave it on. All right. Aftershave we're going to be using today. Matching aftershave. True Fit Inhale Sandalwood Aftershave Balm. 
So we're going to be using. Put a little on there. Well, not a bit because I like a lot of stuff. Probably don't need that much. Yeah, very good scent. I think it smells good. Rub it in there. Yeah, clean, manly, sophisticated, I guess you could say. Very good, clean scent. Sandalwoody. Yeah. Now, the cream reminds me of PAA, um, Future Fixture. The bomb's a little bit different. It's kind of the same, but it's, it's different. It's got a different kind of scent to it. Pretty slick, too. It feels good. But I think, yeah. I think it would pair well with PDA Future Fiction, if you have that one. Just to give you guys an idea of what I think it smells like, because everyone's nose is different, so that's just my nose. You can smell it and be like, dude, you have no idea. <laughs> you can sniff it and be like, man, you have no idea what you're talking about, but that's how we're all different, so oh well. <clears throat> Recap what we used today. True Fit and Hill Sandalwood Aftershave Balm. Nice, nice, nice. You can feel it on there. It feels good. Use T. Allen block. Used Phoenix Arson Accoutrements Nickel Plated DOC. Very, very mild razor with a pretty sharp blade. A Gillette Nasset. First use, but smoother than a feather. We soaked our, we, we soaked, we soaked our brush. <laughs> we soaked our brush in our I Let It Be Shaving coffee mug. Matt Sarsic. Douglas Smythe. We use pre shady cube mentholate to put up charcoal goodness record right. <laughs> I've done that before. I forgot to push record. I'm like, duh. Brush we use today DS Cosmetic 24 millimeter tube bin <sighs> gel tip brush barber pole resin handle. Now you can see what I did. I did not rub it on the towel. All I did was run it under warm water, not really hot water, warm water, squeezed all the uh, product out of there as much as I could and then I just wrung it out like that shook it a bit and that's how I'm gonna let it sit I'm gonna let it sit on the counter just like that until it dries on its own you do not want to rub this on a pet towel you'll ruin it so yeah a little bit of advice for y'all use who never used one before what are you doing kitty hi bud start of the show today first time used true fit in the hill sandalwood shaving cream London, England. Yeah. Very nice. Very good. Smooth. Like I said, if you guys like future fiction, that's what it smells like to me. Don't shoot the messenger. <laughs> yeah. Pretty nice. I wouldn't, I would not, I would not mind using another product by these guys. So yeah, very good. Check it out. It's, it's very nice. Clean, manly. Flip it like a tie. <clears throat> and that's it, ladies and gentlemen. That's the shave of the day. So Hope you ladies and gents have a good day, good week, good shaves, and yeah, that was a damn good shave too. Oh, that balm feels good on your face. Ah, oh, excellent. So, <laughs> see you ladies and gents soon. Bye.